guys, this is Dr. Eileen Yuling Han from the Academy of Acupuncture. For last video, a lot of people ask me, how did you do with all other way of using this Pachi Pachi? So today I'm gonna do another demonstration, how to treat the nose area problems. What is nose area problem? Can be sinus problem, can be nose bleeding, blockage, running, watery nose, primarily or more at the nose area. And uh, I have my model here, Shang, come on in. Very good, here's Shang, <laughs> my model. Now, so in the Chinese medicine or what I practice is called balance method. How are you going to balance the nose? Because we have to identify what is wrong here, right? So what's wrong here? Here is our hand. Yang Ming large intestine and here is the foot Yang Ming stomach meridian so here is more on the head so my quick and dirty way for today we're gonna use a large intestine one to treat anything along here because large intestine treat large intestine large intestine treat the stomach and system number one and the other one is system number six so let me just demonstrate to you when you have anything here with a problem what are you going to do with the whole large intestine meridians? What points are you going to choose? All right, now, here's my model, Sean. His nose is blocked right now. And yesterday he had the nose bleed. So now I'm going to do this. Which side is your nose bleeding? It was more on the right side. What about the blockage? More on the left side. Great job. Okay, now I will choose large intestine one because it's the most easiest one. So it's the gene well point. So he's gonna give me the left hand. So I'm gonna put this right here on the large intestine one and I just gonna patchy, 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 patchy three times. And I'm gonna alternate because he was telling me both sides have issues. So I'm gonna do this. One, two, three. One, two, three. How you feel? The bleeding stopped <laughs> yesterday. And the blockage is better on the left. Okay, one more time. Today. So you can do three more times. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then this one. Once again. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now. About 30% better. Good. All right, let's do it again. That's the easiest way because everybody's fingers are exposed. So what you can do is you can, you, can, you can have this to give it to your patient so they can do, go on and do this for themselves or they can come back to see you. Either way will work. Thank you for watching and see you next time.